Let's see if this next artist has what it takes to turn a chair. My name is Morgan Wallen. I'm 20 years old. I'm from Knoxville, Tennessee, and I'm currently a landscaper. Just go and do what you do best. I started singing when I was about three years old. My mom threw me up on stage at church, and around eight years old, I was entered into a competition, and I came in third. They offered me a record contract, but my mom was like, I want you to have a normal childhood, so we turned it down. Baseball is something that I've always loved since I was a little kid as well. I started traveling around the country playing. I would play over 100 games a year. It was my plan to have a scholarship after high school. My main thing was pitching. My junior season, I threw a curveball and I felt something snap. I found out that I had torn my UCL and the school that I was interested in no longer wanted me because it would take so long to recover from that. It was everything that I'd always wanted and it was just down the drain just like that. I started singing in church a little bit and I was like, man, I think this is something that I could get into. He really is very emotional with his singing. It's beautiful. To hear him sing is just amazing. And I just love him so much. <laughs> my mom and my grandmother, they've always been my biggest supporters in whatever I do. So it means the world for me to have them here. I'm just a normal, small-town kid, and I really don't have a clue how to get into music other than this. I don't have a band. I don't do anything at home. Right now, it's do or die. I don't want to go home and just be that normal landscaper guy again. I want to do this because I love it. I'm so happy that you got chosen by these two uh, lovely people. Thank you very much. It's all about you and me now. That's right. Uh... You know, she hit her button first. I'm a gentleman. Ladies first. Hey, I like, I like that. Oh, thank you, Asha. That's very kind of you. You know, I think highly of you. You are an amazing oh, person. That's a love fest, man. <laughs> I'm so jealous. What's our attention? That's another type of love. <laughs> they don't love us. Hey. <laughs> you know why I turn? Your voice is unique, has this raspy tone, greedy sound to it. And I think that there are no voices like your voice on today's radio. That's why I turned. Thank you. That means a lot to me. Um, yeah. I think it's your turn to make a decision. Well, well, um, wait, 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 wait. Oh, here they go. Okay, claws no, are coming out. Here the claws. claws are coming out. The claws are coming out. The claws are coming out. No, 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 no. <laughs> you have something that is very unique. 
There's not quite a voice like yours on The Voice. It's as manly as it gets. <laughs> I just figured it'd be weird if I said it's very manly. So, I mean, but it I is. I appreciate that. <laughs> cool. Yeah. Uh, so, there were some moments in your performance that I felt like, you know, they were not properly executed. I agree. But that's where coaching comes in and, you know, you have the potential to be any type of artist that you'd like to be. I really would like to win with you, and I'd like you to select me as your coach. Thank you. Thank you very much. This is hard. It's hard. I'm going to have to go. Welcome back to the Blind Auditions. Before the break, Morgan Wallen got the attention of both Shakira and Usher, and now has a tough decision to make. This is hard. This is hard. I'm going to have to go with my man Usher. Morgan is a very unique voice. He's the only voice of the sort that I have on my team. It literally felt like I was in a dream. I like Usher's music personally, and I've seen how he coaches people on the show, and he kind of goes about it like, say, my baseball coach would. You know, he kind of do this, you know, and I, I like to be coached up. Usher beat me this time, but I won't let that happen again. <laughs> While Usher and Shakira continue to bond, 